Um, and that's the Hama uh, Hiroshi Hamaguchi Lamborghini off the road. Nick Nielsen in uh, Imola with the Ferrari Finale Mondiale displaying the race winning. And there was a second incident involving the 59, the 59 going around as well. Derek Debrer, I think, has got that car. It is Ritoma Miata. Miata actually timed as being ahead of Pedersen across the line. Oh, he is ahead, that's why. And a big whack of the kerb there by the AO by TF Sport car, which is going around the outside now, trying to net third position away from Pedersen. Still not quite done it at turn four. That's Robin Kubica aboard the 14 car now. We've got a fair number of the quicker drivers, and that was almost side-to-side -side contact as up the inside there. It's Arthur Leclerc in the number 65 car. Gets up into third place, some potentially exciting stuff to come from Arthur, by the way. LMP2 Pro Am, Alex Quinn leads Varga Pro Racing from Ben Fiscal for Proton. Nielsen Racing's Nick Yellily is in third. AF Corsa, they sit fourth. That's cost him about 15 to 20 seconds in that push. Side by side, though, here for the title contenders in LMP2 Pro Am. Nip and tuck, big lock up for the number 29 car on the outside line. So uh, a trail of tyre smoke in behind. But uh, these guys are have been around the block a few times now. Now there's the five car in the way. Oh, and then more of a touch, and the, the 29 wants the middle of the road. So they're still getting into one another. Phenomenal car control there, particularly from Mathieu Vaxivier. Oh, now trouble off the for road them. is the 21. That's the one that's massively uh, delayed earlier on because of Andy Merrick's trials and tribulations. And Ollie Jarvis is in the gravel. See again, this incident, it was the, up the inside of the Aston Martin for Ollie Jarvis. We, we didn't see that early enough. No, no, I agree. Down the inside. Well, I don't think I'd have put my Orica there. Lamborghini up the inside. The Lamborghini's taken the lead. Incredible. It's going to be Lamborghini to take the win and the title with a pass in the final corner. Absolutely astonishing.